Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I have your 14.10 patch notes, guys. But just as a quick reminder, at 500 subscribers, we're going to be doing a huge announcement that all of you will want to hear. So please, if you are new, to smash that like and hit that subscribe button, guys. It would mean the world. We are growing this channel, and I appreciate all your guys' support. All right, guys, let's get into it with these patch notes here. So if the patch isn't already out, it should be coming out very, very soon. So the first thing this article says is possible Midas and Vandetta fish. These two fish are going to be incredible rare to find. However, these fish are super, super cool. The Midas fish turns everything in your inventory to gold, and the Vendetta fish is going to literally mark enemies on the map. These are going to be such cool fish. However, there is a catch. They're going to be ultra rare. They're going to take a long time to try to find these guys. As you can see, we have a little tweet from Fire Monkey here saying, an official image from Fortnite China about the fishing update added in Season 4. So, will we get the Midas and the Vendetta fish? Probably. Alright, so let's go over some issues real quick. It appears that even if you had licensed audio settings being in the game, you can still hear it. So that's going to be fixed. So that's really good because I had issues with that a couple times myself. Using Bifrost Glow Contrail and the match will drop FPS. That's very true. And now that is going to be fixed. So I'm very glad to hear that. And we had a one creative issue, but it wasn't too big of a deal. All right. Possible. It says new bosses. I think we should be getting some new bosses here very, very soon. Maybe even some new Fortnite Marvel skins. If you guys haven't seen my last video about it, the new Marvel Fortnite skins we're expected to see, make sure you check that out. Link is in the description. We know that Authority is supposed to turn into Stark Labs, meaning Iron Man could become a boss there. We've already seen the Collector's Fort on that mountain. Maybe there's a boss that's going to spawn there. Guys, there's so many options. We don't really know what's going to come into the game. But let me read you this, because this is a good piece of information. We know that more bosses are coming because there's a lot of abilities that were discovered in the files. It appears there'll be an Iron Man, Black Panther, She-Hulk, possible regular Hulk. We spotted some sort of possible regular Hulk in the files. Storm, Thor, and Wolverine at some point in time. They'll apparently be similar to Doctor Doom when you can fight them and take some of their powers to use in-game. More mythic bosses, more mythic weapons, here to come soon. We're so excited about these guys. I think some of these are going to be really overpowered and fun to play with. We have seen some Nick Fury teasers also. A lot of players have spotted his eye patch on the Hell Carrier, so we might see him come as, as a skin. Frenzy Farm might be replaced by Ani Anarchy Acres soon. We might see the return of Anarchy Acres. It's possible. I'm not sure. It's kind of like in the middle. We see another tweet here from Hypex saying all these weird riffs could be just for testing or like, look at these. These are new. Like, Beachy Bluffs, that's a new place. So it's, it's going to be interesting to see what comes into the world of Fortnite here very soon. Looks like the authority will change into Star Labs when Fee 14.10 drops. I feel like it will. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like and smash that subscribe button. And I'll see all of you guys next time.